a new, works on all version, fully automatic, 100% efficient automatic chicken farm for your Minecraft needs. Hey there guys, Skippy here for Room Skippy 6 Gaming. Guys, coming to you from Tutorial Land with Tutorial Love. And we are doing today a fully automatic chicken, bleep, chicken farm. And uh, yeah, it works on all versions, guys. And it's super cool. Guys, gold farms, just meh. I was going to do it, but it sucks. So let's go over here. So see right there, that's what everybody's talking about lately. I've been getting a lot of comments from people on every different version of Minecraft saying, Hey, Skippy, my chicken farm don't work that good anymore. And then it's like, why? Well, why is because what happens is when the dispenser is back here when it shoots out the egg it hits these chickens these chickens jump they usually hit the lava and then they die making it totally irrelevant so that said this thing here does uh, something one better it only ever shoots the lava right before it shoots the egg 100 percent efficient haven't lost a chicken this is less than an hour almost a stack in an hour i'm not even joking uh super cool super awesome so i'm going to give a shout out to Freely Loth, Freely Loth. Either way, I'm gonna link his channel in the description. He's a smaller YouTuber, but I saw this on his channel. I was like, you know, I'm gonna adjust it and make it better, and I just couldn't. It was perfect the way he has it up, guys. It's so easy and simple, and it works across versions. You're gonna see right here. Actually, I'm gonna talk a little more. The next time an egg shoots, it's gonna shoot this fire first. Watch, then the egg, and you see what happens, and it works perfectly efficient. Can't go wrong with that. So I think uh, for this one here, let's go for 328 likes. If you are one of those dudes, uh, hit me up in the comments. Let me know. I always like to hear from people. And uh, yeah, so I'm going to find the ingredients for this uh, chicken farm. I put it somewhere. That's that door right there. Uh, I think that's the door. Maybe it's not. Maybe that's the chicken farm. Oh, it's totally the chicken farm. So let's grab the ingredients for the chicken farm, and I'm going to tell you what you need, guys. For this build, you're going to need one chest, four hoppers, uh, two observers, four repeaters, one comparator, two dispensers, three redstone dust, one glowstone, one carpet, one bucket of lava. Just bring a half a stack of blocks, four pieces of glass, and uh, uno half slabo, por favor. And that's my... Uh, language there but yeah so uh let's do it guys super easy in the ground right here look at that easy peasy lemon squeezy let's go ahead and grab look at that as soon as i do that you know what happens is i can't get my blocks of choice because my blocks of choice need to be in your hand all the time uh let's go like this so let's just start this is the front we're gonna go one deep it's gonna be three wide and it's going to be uh six uh six long i don't know if i need that much maybe maybe not but uh yeah start with this guy right here grab that hopper i just took out of my inventory right here bingo bingo right there looks good to me so let's grab that why do i keep taking those solid blocks there we go so let's build it up okay so first things first one two three on this side one two three on this side Go over here, and what you're going to want is a one, two, one, two. Then you want to grab those dispensers. Dispenser. Dispenser. Right here. Looking good, looking good. Go ahead and grab that half slab uh, right here, the one that you need. I'm not going to take that guy out yet. Let's, you know, carpet is what messed me up here. So go ahead and throw your half slab right on top of this guy. Feeling good, looking good. And, yeah, so let's go ahead and uh, start this... Uh, start to show on the road so go ahead and grab your hopper a hopper is gonna go into this guy make sure your crouch place with your right trigger in hopper into that guy hopper into that guy looks good to me now let's go over here and what we're gonna do is let's go ahead and cover up the back of this just like that looks good this guy goes down here goes over there if you're as good this is gonna be where your chickens go right here so let's get our little uh let's get our redstone out of the way this guy's gonna go here we want this guy on the level with that we're gonna want a comparator right there feeling good looking good and yeah go ahead and grab a observer block crouch place right trigger in throw it on the side of that comparator looking good again again solid block here make a quick t-shaped like this bust this guy out go ahead and carry this guy over now 
as you can see with this one, what we want to do is basically carry it over from here. So there's going to be uh, one, two, three blocks going all the way up to that dispenser. So let's do it. One, two, three blocks going there. And on this side, we're going to have the same thing, but one of them is going to be a little different. So let's just put our three blocks for now. Grab your redstone repeaters again. We're just going to put a quick, well not quick, actually the opposite, long tick delay over here. We're going to put three repeaters at a four tick delay. One, two, three, four ticks. One, two, three, one, two, three, one, two, three. Redstone dust right here. Now that we've done this, we're going to do something a little similar. We're going to put a repeater this way, redstone dust this way, and then make sure you pay close attention. You want the face of this guy facing you. So go like this see that we got the face on the guy hitting the tick and we're ready to go so as you can see this is most of the redstone work is actually done uh, the one thing that will happen here is you want to get ready in the front of your thing let's go ahead and take this guy out there's so many animals let's grab uh, let's grab this glass so glass glass um, on this one here this is where everything's gonna stay so for that uh, glowstone we're gonna use this glowstone right here and go ahead and throw that glowstone right here. It'll keep everything lit up, looks good. And yeah, so I think I put a solid block right here when I did it the first time. So now this is going to be where your chickens are. So let's get ready. Block them in. <laughs> you could crouch if you want, but you wanna make this guy right here, just like this. So it doesn't have to be too high, but it does because basically you can make it too high for now. And then after you could do what I did and wait till they're in there. So basically you're going to use seeds and just get two chickens. That's all you really need. I would put as many as you can. If you're on any version other than bedrock, you're going to have a limit of 25 entities in one spot before they start dropping dead. This chicken farm here is literally 20 chickens. So it's really productive with 20. If you're on a non bedrock platform, you will have a limit when you get to your cap. So uh, you're going to get your chickens in there. Another thing is go ahead and throw a carpet on this guy. So we don't have any uh, glitches going on with the chickens and we're good. So now that this guy's all done right here, let's grab some, uh, Let's grab a chicken egg. So we're going to put a couple chickens in. So we should be feeling good because guess what? It's pretty much working as it is. Uh, again, make sure you don't have over your limit of chickens. Let's see if we can't uh, grab a few uh, eggs. So don't spam this. You shouldn't spam it. It will clog it. But what you can do is... And the egg went. So the last thing that we did is we didn't put our lava in this guy right here. Put your lava in. Oh, last but not least, let's add this guy right here. And that will add the lava. I was wondering what's going on. We still don't have any chickens coming through yet, but they will. Guys, for the win, you have it. Don't forget that last piece of lava. It's working perfect. I just need a chicken to, uh, a chicken to come through. You know what we'll do? <laughs> ah! Don't forget to smash the like before you go, guys. Don't forget as well to subscribe to my channel for uh, some more tutorials and Let's Plays and uh, awesome stuff. Thanks a lot for tuning in, and I'll catch you on the next one.